Internationally acclaimed Palestinian poet Mahmoud Darwish died Sunday after complications from heart surgery. Considered one of the greatest contemporary Arab poets, Darwish's work was regarded as the quintessential voice of Palestinian exile, and his death has come as a shock to Palestinians in the occupied territories and abroad. Let's hear from Darwish himself reading in Jerusalem. In Jerusalem, and I mean within the ancient walls, I walk from one epoch to another without a memory to guide me. The prophets over there are sharing the history of the holy, ascending to heaven and returning less discouraged and melancholy. Because love and peace are holy and are coming to town. I was walking down a slope and thinking to myself, how do the narrators disagree over what light said about a stone? Is it from a dimly lit stone that wars flare up? I walk in my sleep, I stare in my sleep, I see no one behind me, I see no one ahead of me. All this light is for me. I walk, I become lighter, I fly, then I become another. Transfigured words sprout like grass from Isaiah's messenger mouth. If you don't believe, you won't believe. I walk as if I were another, and my wound a white biblical rose and my hands like two doves on the cross, hovering and carrying the earth. I don't walk, I fly, I become another, transfigured. No place and no time, so who am I? I am no I in a sentence presence, but I think to myself, alone, the Prophet Muhammad spoke classical Arabic, and then what, then what, a woman soldier shouted, is that you again, didn't I kill you, I said, you killed me, and I forgot, like you, to die.